Welcome back to OASIS, the Oversized Access State Interstate System. This video will guide you through the steps for ordering a reducible annual permit. A reducible annual permit is an annual permit issued to haul reducible loads. Per Mass DOT Permit Department Guidelines, reducible annual permits are not self-issued permits. Customers will be able to log in to OASIS and complete a reducible annual permit application and submit payment. However, the permit will not be issued until the Permit Department reviews the application, assigns a decal number, and then approves and issues the permit. To order a reducible annual permit, select I know which permit I need from the drop-down menu under New Permit and click Start Permit. The company data fields should automatically populate with your company information. Correct any missing or incorrect information and make sure everything here is up to date. The primary and optional additional delivery method will have no bearing on the permit delivery. Once the permit type is selected, the system will know this is a mail-only permit and the permit will not be delivered by the selected methods. The company reference is an optional field on the permit application that enables you to associate a permit to a particular job, job number, or some other internal tracking. This option is not required and has been provided as a service to OASIS companies. If information is entered in the company reference text box, you will be able to search on that information and generate a report for all permits associated to that reference. Select Reducible Annual from the drop-down list for permit type. Enter the start date for the permit by clicking in the From field and choosing a date from the pop-up calendar. Please note that the start date cannot be earlier than today and is limited by the permit type as to how many days in advance it can be ordered. The end date will automatically populate for you based on the particular permit type you requested. For a reducible annual, it should be one year from the start date. Click Next to go to the Order Permits page. Enter information about your vehicle and load in the Truck and Load Information screen. If you have already saved a vehicle in the company information screen, you can choose that vehicle from the drop-down list and it will pre-populate the known information about the vehicle into the form. The MA registration weight should be the registered gross vehicle weight from the registration or cab card. Select a load description from the drop-down list. For this example, we will use construction materials. Enter the load dimensions for the load being hauled. Please note that the legal weight, permit cost, and maximum combined vehicle weight will automatically be populated based on information entered. The requested weight cannot be greater than the maximum combined vehicle weight. If there is already a permit issued for the VIN entered, the system will prompt you. Please note that a gross vehicle weight rating, or GVWR, must be uploaded into the system to continue the application process. If the GVW for the VIN has not been certified for the vehicle, the system will prompt you to upload the GVWR certification. You will need to complete this step before you can continue. Upload the GVWR certification by clicking the link and browsing your computer to submit the document. Click the Next button to continue the application once all information is entered and verified. The system will bring you to the valid registration or cap card upload. Upload the cap card registration to the system to continue. Please note that from this page, you can also view your previously uploaded documents, or click Cancel and Close to close the document upload screen and return to the special items for individual permits screen. Click the Next button to continue with the application process. The next screen will ask you for your mailing information. Since these permits must be mailed to you, you will need to fill out the correct shipping address and how you want them delivered. They can be sent to you by the Postal Service in regular mail, or you can upload a shipping label or walk in to get your permit. Select the courier from the drop-down provided. If you want regular mail, fill out the correct shipping address where they will need to be mailed. Click the Next button to go to the Permit Summary page. From here, you can review all the information entered to validate and make sure everything is correct. Click Submit to submit your permit application order. The Permit Submission Successful screen should display. Please note that the permit application has been sent to a Mass DOT user for approval. Once the application is approved, you will receive your permit PDF and decal via the mailing delivery method selected during the application process. According to Mass DOT current business practices, a reducible annual permit is not active without being accompanied by the associated decal. This concludes the OASIS user tutorial video on reducible annual permits. Thanks for watching and don't forget more videos are available for your convenience.